Good morning guys, or good afternoon. Um, yes, it is afternoon. Welcome back to another video. Look who I'm with. How are you doing? Very well, thank you. How are, are you? Are you well? Hello vlog! I'm here with Jack. Me and Jack have one common interest. We have lots of common interests, but the main one being our motorbikes. So if you don't like motorcycles, or you don't like beautiful English countryside, then click off. Hopefully all, of, off. Hopefully, all of you, hopefully all of you will stay. I'm also really, really bummed out because I've forgotten one of the mounts for my GoPro for my helmet, which means I can't clip it to my helmet. So, rookie error, I was in a bit of a rush this morning. I spilt paraffin, um, if you're from America, which no one is, that's um, kerosene all over my stuff. So all of my stuff down here, it's all stinking of petrol and covered in fuel. So we've headed 10 minutes from where Jack lives to um, this place, which is Sammy Miller's Motorcycle Museum. And yeah, if you can't gather already, it's filled with motorcycles. There must be a couple of hundred here at least, um, if not more. Big collection. Um, even if you don't ride bikes, I think it's pretty cool to come here and see all the history and everything. This is nearly as old as my dad. We just had um, two burgers, but um, they went down a bit too fast. They were good, huh? Focus, focus. Tasty, no? Mm. But yeah, we're jumping back on the bikes now. Very cool museum, lots of retro old stuff. And I think for some reason, maybe because I'm younger, more interested in like, sh bike shows where it's all new stuff and new gear and new motorcycles. But very interesting. Yeah, it was. Yeah, no, it was cool. English thing you can do. It's bank holiday weekend just gone and it's sunny so we've come to the beach doing little photo shoot missions and I'm making Jack run around the rocks. If anyone didn't watch the Wales vlog I'm gonna put them in the link below. But that's basically where Jack is. I'll introduce Jack properly in a second because it's windy as hell here. But quickly, this is my bike. If you don't know already, I like riding motorcycles. This one in particular because it's mine, funnily enough. It's a Honda CBF 500. It's about 10 years old now. 11 now. 11 years old. And this is Jack's brand new, basically, Ninja 600. 650. So, back at Jack's. To introduce me and Jack. We both went to school together. If you didn't watch the Wales vlogs, go watch them. They were fun. Um, we both went to that school. And Jack's still obviously emphatically in love with it because he's wearing his hockey. Is that, am I right? It's your hockey yeah, goalkeeping hockey jumper? Sport. See, I knew that, even though I don't really play hockey. And, um, oh, Dominic, don't get jealous. Bit of Beppo. Yeah. What am I doing? So we're heading off to this, I'm out of focus. We're heading off to this bike night thing now, um, in pool. Um, unfortunately, absolutely everything smells of paraffin. My backpack, my clothes, all of this reeks of paraffin. Um, if anyone knows how to get rid of paraffin, comment in the comment section below, because um, even though I upload this probably a week, two weeks after I film this, it will probably still all reek of paraffin, because I don't know how to do it. So if anyone's got a secret idea, let us know. Hello, an hour later on the mo bikes. Um, I didn't even bother with the GoPro because I wasn't going to fiddle around trying to flick it in, but it wasn't going to work. So no GoPro footage of us riding, but we're here in pool. Um, I think this is sicker than we thought it was going to be, eh? Yeah. This is amazing. Like, this is crazy. We've got hundreds and hundreds of bikes all flooding in. Here we are parked up. This one and this one. Um, and you live, you've been living an hour away from here your entire life and you never, never come. So your dad must have been at least once. I think he's been to the one in Southampton a few times. Yeah. Anyway, so I think it's time to go and explore and take some photos of these incredible machines and get jealous, basically. <laughs> so what I like is because basically, I don't know what the premise is, I don't know how this started, I should look it all up. Jack basically just messaged me and said, hey, when you come down, we're going to bike night. But it's just, it's raising awareness, I think, for people who don't ride motorcycles, that they're out there, they're affordable, there's a big culture for motorcycles. Um, 
and that they're there to be celebrated. Wouldn't you agree? Oh, this is amazing. This uh, like all different kind of bikers, sports bikes, Harleys, trial bikes, normal people like me who commute in London and stuff, but like their bikes. This is what this is all about. If any bike is a chode, that's pretty much the definition. I know it looks big, but it isn't really. That's that's the Triumph Explorer in comparison, and that's Monsieur Chodo with El Fato tire. So it's starting to get really, really, really busy now. We're all the way down at the other end of the pier. Pier? Yeah. Key, quay. Key. Is it key? Not quay? It's spelled quay. It's not one of those Philip moments where I completely get the word wrong and try and make something up. Anyway, and it's getting super, super busy. We've got a lot of motorcycles here. And a lot of seagulls for the fish and chips. So forget about the bikes Jack just said. Next purchase, that. That is a big, bad yacht. It's practically a car, this one. Four seats. That's the other, um, that's the other very refreshing thing about this, motorcycles, pubs. I think there'd be more police here, policing this. This has obviously been going on a while, a while but the only bike policeman I've seen is this fella here. That's basically it. And then, like Jack said, it probably polices itself. It goes on. and there's still bikes rolling in and the sun's popped out for us. Heading off now, time to leave. What time did we get here? Five. We have been here two and a half hours to be fair. Doesn't feel like that. Um, so we're heading back to where Jack lives now. Definitely makes me want to buy something a little bit bigger, a little bit quicker. Um, I've got to pass my second test first. Two minutes away from the pub as well. Oh, easy. We've just stopped off because Jack lives right next to the new forest. I hope you can hear me. And the light is absolutely perfect now. So I'm going to get some shots of Jack as soon as we ride back up there. Jack is currently being my model and I'm getting a few shots from riding the bikes because the sun is just too perfect right now with no clouds. It's a lovely evening. Dunset mission was an absolute success. Would you not agree? Yeah, lovely, look at it. In the trees. Absolutely fantastic. It is, we did just time it perfectly though because it's just ducked behind the trees and all the light that was on this road has vanished. But look at this. If you don't know where we are, I don't think I even explained it. We're in the New Forest. Jack lives right next to the New Forest. And it's absolutely gorgeous. If you've never been here, you need to come here. It's down by Limington, which is where you get the ferry to the Isle of Wight, if you ever go into the Isle of Wight. It's absolutely gorgeous here, and it's unfortunate that all the roads are 40 miles an hour, which we are strictly adhering to. Um, but yeah, it's amazing here. Very, very pretty. You've been very lucky to have grown up here. Do you know that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, look at it. This is my kingdom. I'm now currently at the pub Jack works in. Which is called the Hare and Hounds. Say goodbye, Jack. Just to do your really awkward thing for the vlog, Jack. Jack was actually, to be fair to him, in the Wales vlogs, very on point. Yeah, he was very, very lively. On, yeah, noticed, everyone does that. Have you seen so the ones? I'm really nervous in front of the camera. And I so, no, no, how, so how, how's, 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 I'm alright in front of the camera. It doesn't bother no, what me. What happens is, right? This is Jack's boss, by the way. If no one knows, Jack's boss has been serving us drinks. Really on YouTube and friends and family. Do you see what I mean, right? You start talking, and then. Yeah, this is this is this and this. It takes over. You don't get a word in every, so I just sit there quietly. Like, do you know why? Because no one else has got anything interesting to say apart from me. And you do kind of rant quite a lot as well, Jack. You do go on, and then you start to blush because you've got the camera pointing at you, which you're about to do now. <laughs> but you're, but you're on, you're underneath the light, so you don't blush. I know. I know. It shows my grey hair there. That's the unfortunate. A little bit. A little bit true.